Education, as we know, is a top issue for lawmakers in Austin this legislative session. Part of that is school safety. And as ABC 13 reporter Tom Abrams tells us, one local representative is pushing a law that would put an extra layer of security in every classroom in Texas. We see the disturbing images, hear the gut-wrenching pain. Most of those kids were my friends. And we ask the same questions again Look, and again and again. How do you even... Santa Fe 2018, Uvalde 2022. My Texas has 6 million students, children, in 1,200 districts, every one of them a potential target. As we've seen too many times, seconds really do matter when it comes to an emergency on a school campus. Here in Willis ISD, they have taken that approach and they have armed every staff member on every campus with a panic button available to them on their cell phones. We evaluate security, you know what's working, what's not working, it's a daily conversation. Tim Harkrider is the Willis ISD superintendent. Since 2018, they have used the Rave Panic application. Harkrider calls it one of their security tools. It caught my attention, number one, because it's an app. Everybody has a cell phone, so the connection was pretty seamless. Willis staff trains on the app every year as part of ongoing security and safety awareness. It is not the only district using panic alarms, but State Representative Sean Terry of Houston wants them in every classroom across the state. It's software that allows teachers, students, faculty, in the event of an active shooter or any other emergency to immediately communicate with first responders. She has introduced House Bill 669, which would require panic alarms in some form. She's already secured a $20 million grant, she says, to help districts pay for it. I think everyone now sees the importance of school safety. We cannot continue to kick the can down the road. She seems to have bipartisan support. Senate Bill 838 is its companion, and the chair of the Senate's Education Committee, Republican Brandon Creighton, backs Terry's efforts. I think school safety for many of the members, most of the members, would be at the top of the list, um, without a doubt. It certainly is a priority for Tim Harkrider and his district. I hope we pay for this for the next hundred years and never have to use it, but you know, we've got to be prepared and, and ready uh, to protect our staff members and, and kids uh, when something terrible uh, does happen.